Let's kick things off with a quote today. This is a quote from Hal Elrod, author of Miracle Morning and an all-around amazing guy. So the quote says, Although actions may speak louder than words, it is our intentions that reveal our soul. Yep, you guessed it. We're going to be talking about intentions today, so stick around. We'll dive right into it. Hello, Self Love Tribe. Today we're going to be talking about intentions. We've all heard it in our yoga classes. Set your intention. What is your intention for the day? We've heard it in books, we've heard it in journaling. But what is it? What is an intention? And what is it about intentions that are so important in the creation of our lives? So intentions are really powerful things. It's like an affirmation, but with an unshakable belief. So whatever it is that you want to experience, set an intention that you will experience Whatever it is that you want to feel, set an intention that you will feel that. Intentions are powerful. What happens when you set an intention? The universe is listening and the universe will deliver that in some way, shape or form. It may not be exactly how you wanted it to be packaged, but I assure you it will be sent to you. And we've all had that experience of, you know, when we, uh, are afraid of all, all the stuff that could go wrong and then all of a sudden stuff goes wrong. Well, it's because you've put that out into the universe. So if you want things to go well, set the intention. What is it that you want to feel? What is it that you want to experience? Put that out into the universe and see what happens. Intentions are powerful, but it's also that unshakable belief behind that intention that is going to get you to where you want to be. Intentions speak from your soul. Don't speak from a superficial place. Don't speak from ego. Don't speak from mind. Speak from your soul. What is it that you want to manifest in your life? Is it happiness? Is it joy? Is it love? What does it look like to you? What is it that you want to manifest? And if the thing, I mean, if for you it's like, I want to manifest a bigger paycheck, get to the bottom of the why. Why do you want to manifest a bigger paycheck? What will that do for you? Get to the bottom, dig deep, understand the why in regards to what it is that you truly want to manifest in your life. Because if you just say, I want to manifest a bigger paycheck, you're not dipping into the actual emotional connection behind that. Perhaps as I want to, perhaps it, I want to manifest a bigger paycheck so that I can begin to experience life the way I want to experience and provide for my family and pay for education or whatever it is because that's going to make me feel whole. That's going to make me feel fulfilled. This is going to bring me joy. Get to the bottom of what it is that you want to experience, why you want to experience it, and then set an intention around it. Get really clear on your vision. Get really clear on what it is that you want to see in your life and create that unfaltering, unshakable belief that it will happen and then be open to receiving. And, and remember, it can be sent to you in a completely different package than what you imagined in your mind. But it will be sent to you. As long as you maintain that unshakable belief, it will be sent to you. Intentions are so powerful. So when you go to your next yoga class and they say set your intention for the day, keep that in mind that this is a very powerful moment for you to decide what it is that you want to experience that day. What it is that you want to feel that day. Intentions are so powerful. So be mindful of the in intentions that you're putting out into the universe. And be aware of the whys behind the intention. To ensure that you're creating the life that you truly want. The life that you truly desire. A life that you ridiculously love. So be mindful of those intentions. And surround yourself with people who create good intentions as well. It's good to be inspired. So if you have any questions or comments about intentions, please enter them in the comments below. Or if you just want to share with me what your intention is, I'd love to hear it. What is your intention today? That's a great question to ask yourself every morning. What is my intention today? How do I want to feel? 
I am sending you all so much love and light. Thank you so much for tuning in. Namaste.